Well, hello everybody and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. I was so kindly sent this newest book of, and I'm probably not pronouncing this right, Radu Frazzi, something like that. Um, this one is called Kingdom of Flowers, Adult Coloring Book. There are 50 different illustrations in this book. It's got a, a matte kind of, uh, not velvety feeling, but you know, it's not the glossy cover like most of our coloring books have. And this is the back of the book. It says this book is ideal for stress relieving and relaxation. Arm yourself with your favorite pens, crayons, coloring pencils, or markers, and release your creativity with a broad variety of flower designs which pop out from the page. It says there are 50 different well-crafted floral illustrations. Color test page to see how your coloring supplies react to the paper. Every illustration is printed on a single-sided page, which is something we always look for, right? Ideal for stress relieving and relaxation. Simple to advanced complex complexity. Excellent for adults and kids alike. So, let's see what's in the book. Okay, here we have the title and copyright page. You see it's a smaller size than your standard uh, 8.5 by 11. So, it's a little bit shorter, but it is the same width as a standard coloring book. Here it is asking for, if you like it, to go ahead and leave your online review. Here is your t uh, color test page. And then we start into the book itself. Let me zoom you in just a tad. Okay. Oh, that's pretty. Beautiful flowers leaves. This would work great with pencils, I bet. Alcohol markers, not so much, but water base would work good in here. And my gel pens. A lot of variety of flowers in here. Some butterflies in that one. Oh, this would be a great fall picture and so. Do a lot of your blending and shading in these pictures. Coming up with all different color schemes. This one's a little bit more simplistic. So this one, maybe you could use your alcohol markers. Of course, putting a blotter page back behind. Mm. I definitely will be coloring a picture out of here in the near future for a color and chat. Maybe using a combination of marker and gel pen and maybe even throwing in some colored pencil. <laughs> I know, unusual for me. Oh, look at that. I bet you that would be gorgeous when it's done with a pencil. Mm. He draws flowers so well. And the different kinds of leaves, too, that he puts on his pictures. A lot of times you always see kind of the same types of leaves, but you'll notice a lot of his pictures have different kinds of leaves. So you can use a lot of different color combination on the leaves. You know, so a variety of leaves within the same picture. Mm. 
These remind me of like celery leaves, you know, on the top of the stalks of celery. <laughs> Oh, that's neat. You have some darker black lines in that one. Butterfly in that one. Oh, another one. Oh, look at all them butterflies. Oh, just think of the color combos you could come up with these. Mm, mm, mm. You know I love my butterflies. <laughs> and then butterflies and flowers together. Well, that's just the ideal combination, right? So yeah, he does have periodic butterflies in here too. So a lot of pictures in this book, but it is, like I said, it's shorter, so it's a great book to take on the go with, you know, if you have doctor's appointments or something. And then you do have a blank sheet back here that you could also test out some of your mediums or maybe you want to test out some color combinations. Um, so that's always nice to have that in the back too. So that is the book. Again, it is called Kingdom of Flowers by Radu Frazi. And I will link this book down below in case you are interested in purchasing it. So I hope you enjoyed this flip through of this book. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you are new to my channel. I hope everybody had a terrific weekend and as always, happy coloring. Bye guys.